Hi everyone, welcome back to another Tech Fury YouTube video. In today's video, I'm gonna show you how to make your Windows 11 PC look good. Okay, uh, as you can see, this is my live wallpaper. And also, if you check on this area, which is taskbar, you can see it's rounded and it's centered. And this, these uh, icons also, this section also is rounded. And also my mouse pointer is different, not like that boring Windows 10 and 11 mouse pointer. So let me show you how to do all this in this video. Okay, the first thing we are going to do is uh, changing this curse. So I'm going to show you. For First of all, go to the first link in the description below and download this application. I'm going to download it now. And go to the download folder. I'm going to refresh it. And right now, right click it and extract all the files. In here, go to the folder. And in, in here you can choose either dark version or the light version of this mount point, mouse pointer. And I'm going to choose dark. So I'm going to double go to the dark version. And as you can see all the icons are shown in here. And I'm going to right click this install.inf file. And click install. If you don't have this option install option. Uh, it's because Windows 11 has changed this uh, layout. You just need to go down and click more properties and uh, click on the install button. So I'm going to click install. And as you can see, it's open that open that uh, mouse point to I mean, mouse properties and the point uh, tab. And as you can see, it's the this icon. Now what you have to do is to change this. We'll just click on it and choose Windows 11 Cursor Dark uh, version 2 by Jeffrey Creations. Click on that and click Apply. Uh, so click on Apply and click on Yes and click OK to close it. As you can see, the icon has been changed. Uh, this, okay, that's it for this section. Okay, the second application we are going to use today for live lively wallpaper. So I have put the disc, uh, link in the description below in this video description. You can click on it and go to this page. In here, click on download and click on download installer and it will download the application okay it's finished almost finished okay uh it's downloaded what you get, what you need to do now is click on it to open the setup And then click. Um, I'm gonna click install for me only and click OK now. In here, click on next. I accept the agreement and next, next, and next, and install. So it's pretty simple setup. You just need to press next, next, and install. That's all. Right now it's extracting all the files uh, for lively wallpaper to work. Okay, it's installed now. I'm gonna minimize this web browser. And uh, I'm gonna launch it, so I'm gonna click finish. In here, you need to click on next, next, and next. And in here you can change this taskbar theme, 
to be clear, blur or anything you want. Right now I'm not going to do this and I'm going to click next. And now what you need to do is, uh, you can see this icon right uh, in the taskbar. You can see lively wallpaper. If you don't see this, click on that uh, arrow icon and you will be able to see that. Right click that one and click open lively. Okay, this is the application. Um, this is pretty easy. You just need to uh, choose either one of these and and you can just click on it and see whether it's good or not. Then you can keep it. If it is not good, you can choose another thing. So I'm going to click uh, this rain version 2. As you can see, it's changed. Now it's, it's like a raining effect and what else we have we have this one click on let's see okay that's good what else we have okay, we have this one fluid version 2 so this is an interactive one if you move your uh, cursor it will go with that flow so that's pretty amazing uh, what else we have <laughs> We have the hill. Okay, that's that's pretty. Um, so that's how we. Oh, we have mat, ma, matrix, matrix rain custom. Oh, it's it's like uh, like hacking thing, no? So that okay. So that's how you change your wallpaper to be live one. So I'm gonna choose this one because that's I think that's the best one. As you can see, it's like a sunset, but it's in 3D. So it's like you are in a game in the wallpaper. So okay, uh, so that's how you change that one. Okay, uh, the third application we are going to use today uh, is this one, which is rounded TV. Uh, which means rounded uh, taskbar so what you're gonna do is uh, this link it will be in the description as always you can go to this link and scroll down and you can see the round tv uh, zip file you just need to click on it to download okay now go to that folder downloads folder this is the application what you need to do is right click and extract okay now copy this folder and put it uh, move it to i mean copy it to c drive and open this folder i have done that because this is not a setup which will install into your c drive this is just an application file so if you mistakenly remove that from clear the downloads folder it, this will be deleted so that's why we put uh, it into c drive so in here scroll down and you can see this uh, rounded tv exe file double click and it's enabled now what you can do is uh, as you can see this is uh, rounded by default because i have already used that one i mean i have already uh, use down TV so what you need to do is open this uh, right click this one and show around the TV and here click on advance and you need to first time you install this will be disabled so if you apply this is how it works so what you need to do is click on dynamic show system tray and click apply and you can see this section is rounded and separated from the taskbar you can set up margins like if you uh, put higher margin like 10 you can see these icons are different have margins so i think it's best to have two or zero if you need zero but i think two is good so 
you just need to put to and co corner radius which mean if you uh, max it out it will that corner of your taskbar it will like more curve so if you max it out you can see it's curve very like a uh, like a shape so i'm gonna reduce it i think it's like uh, 15 or maybe 10 12 oh yeah 12 is enough i think 12 is good okay so click uh, uh, apply and close it and also you just need to right click it and click run at startup because otherwise when when you restart your machine this will not not open up and it will not work so you just need to put run at startup then every time you uh, restart your machine it will be the same so that's how you change your windows 11 look look a little bit better and like i know windows 11 is looks amazing but this will make uh, the windows 11 look uh, more better and more beautiful so that's how you do it see you next time with another awesome video like this subscribe to this channel if you like this video and also like this video and see you next time with another video bye bye see you